A former Miamisburg middle school teacher is now behind bars after being convicted on sexual battery charges. Jessica Langford learned her fate of one year in prison and five years probation at a sentencing hearing today. Two News reporter Kristen Eskow was inside the courtroom when she was sentenced. It was a packed courtroom for Jessica Langford's sentencing. The judge says he took into account the seriousness of the crime before sentencing her to one year in prison and five years probation. I would like to tell you how deeply sorry I am to you, your family, and everyone else impacted by my actions on May 23rd, 2017. Former Miamisburg middle school teacher Jessica Langford tears up reading a letter in court to the victim in the case. She was convicted on three counts of sexual battery and three counts of unlawful sexual conduct with a minor after having a sexual relationship with a 14-year-old boy. I take full accountability for my actions and choices I made. We should not have been alone together at all, especially in my classroom. Langford also made a statement to Judge Timothy O'Connell, telling him she's gotten counseling and asking him to consider her mother with stage four cancer and her daughter. Please don't punish her for my mistakes. Judge O'Connell cited the victim's age, 14, and the teacher-student relationship they previously shared as reasons for giving her time behind bars. Before sentencing, the victim's father also gave a statement. We are withholding his identity and disguising his voice to protect the privacy of the victim. She was an adult, trusted, within her classroom not to sexually assault him. She should have been that adult and said, no, none of this can happen. The victim's father also added life has been a struggle for his son as he asked the judge to impose the harshest penalty. He feels embarrassed and alone. He's bullied constantly at school and feels alone and helpless. Before court was adjourned, Langford was led away to begin court serving her sentence. Langford must now also register as a tier three sex offender. Prosecutors tell us they were looking for more prison time but are satisfied with the sentence. In Dayton, Kristen Eskow, 2 News, working for you.